God gives dreams that can always happen. I'm Bishop Rudolph McKissick, Jr. I am the lead pastor here at the Bethel Church. Bethel is the oldest existing Baptist church in the state of Florida. So after the Civil War, all of the white slave masters took all the freed slaves to court because they said to the judge, listen, slavery is over. They are no longer our property. We don't want them in our church. And it's ironic, the judge saw that by number, there were more freed slaves than slave masters. So the judge awarded the church to the freed slaves. This is a church that has been authorized for vocational training because back then there was nowhere that blacks could really go. Bethel has always been an educational institution. In every era of this church, the bedrock has been something dealing with education, which makes our scholarthon so powerful. When you get a certain age, the grants aren't there. There's no money. My mom's an immigrant. I didn't have a college fund. So I had to put school on hold. And so I started taking one class at a time. One class at a time, because that's all I could afford. So for this year's Scholarthon, we were able to award 82 persons, undergrad and graduate level, with a $1,200 scholarship. Shamara has overcome a lot in her life. After going with, through what she's gone through, especially medically, she's had two brain surgeries. A lot of people would have given up after that because that's already a burden. You have to apply. And so this scholarship, when Bethel offered it, it didn't have an age limit. It's a huge boost to like, I can do this, I'm gonna finish, people believe in me. She said, I can do it no matter what and be a testimony to other people. Shamara is going to be a game changer. It really, really impacted my life. It helped me live. Like, didn't only help me for school. It helped me live so I can go to school. This degree has also changed my life financially. It has changed my son's life trajectory because they can see, like, mommy did it. So there's no excuse. I am a black woman. I'm a Latina woman and I am a teacher, and I love what I do. My passion is teaching special needs, and so I just love to prove people wrong. Like, you can give me your worst, I will make them your best. We didn't want no to be on anybody's agenda to go back to school or to go to school. And so the Scholarthon became our answer to the no.